so let's get started this is my portable washer and dryer as you guys can see I left the plastic on just in case I you know one day just want to resell it or give it away or even for myself if I want if I want to see that it's super clean I could just bloop, take it off and it'll be fine it has three little modes here this is the timer this is what kind of selection I want gentle normal or you know to drain it we use this all the time and then right here there's a spin timer this is for the drain also so this is technically the dryer but it's an air dry if that makes any sense this is the front and now this is the back So the plug went here and the hose right over here. I think this is ready. So I am going to close this. I am going to stop this right here. Perfect. And I'm going to leave it normal. I'm going to go all the way to right here. I want to show you guys what this looks like. Now we wait. Let's talk about pros because I love, love, love this little machine so much. So the first pro is that it's a really good investment. I only paid $100 and I use it two to three times a week and I've been using it now for a whole year. Two, because it's so small, like with size, I can put it anywhere, you know, in my apartment. I can leave it in the kitchen if I want to. I have, right now I have it in the bedroom, but I could also leave it like in the hallway or one of my hallways without a problem, without it feeling too crowded. Three, it doesn't make a lot of noise. Um, that was a big one just because you know obviously New York City apartments are small smaller than average and I didn't want to disturb like my neighbors so I do it at like 11 p.m. and it does not make a lot of noise another one this one's one of the easiest one it's portable you can move it around if you're moving anywhere like my little arms have no strength they have, they have zero strength and I'm able to just move it around without a problem all by myself it's really easy to use you just have to plug it into the wall put the little uh, drainer hose, you know, somewhere. <laughs> I do it on the toilet. Some people use the tub, but I don't really want to drain my tub that way. So this works really, really well with me. I can just flush it down kind of thing. Um, yeah, and then just find another place to basically connect the water with, and then it begins, and that's it. The only con that I could find with this little machine right here, the portable washer and dryer, is that you need to be involved. So for example, for me, outside of YouTube, you know, I'm a teacher and I'm home by 3, 3.30 p.m., the latest 4 p.m., so I have plenty of time to do my laundry. But if you're working, you know, crazy hours, like 60, 70 hours, and you just want to put in your clothes and not have to worry about how it washes and how it dries and stuff like that, then probably this is not for you. But I would say if you just have like a good hour in your day to do this, then it's no problem. I only say you have to be really hands-on with it because it is up to you to you know make sure that you turn the knobs to drain it that you refill the water again again drain it the second time and then you have to move it from the left to the right you know to dry it so it's just one of those things that you have to be a little bit more involved but then again it doesn't take much and you get really used to it once you have it and for me it's like a little fun thing because it's believe it or not for me i i think of this as like a self-care thing because it feels just so good when you wash your clothes and I don't know, I just, it feels good. <laughs> All right, I think our 15 minutes are up, so let's check it out. It is finished. So I am going to click drain right here. And now this starts going down and right there. We just finished draining, and now the only thing we have to do is repeat the steps all over again put on the water, wait for it to, you know, get full, which is about three minutes, then put 15 minutes while it washes, drain it again, and then we can put it in the dryer. And now we wait and wait 
and wait, wait, wait while our clothes are washing. We wait while our clothes are washing. Let's sing a song together, guys. We can do this. Let's make a song up about washing our clothes in New York City, washing our life away. I love to wash my clothes in this bathroom. Wash, 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 wash them away. And my dogs are barking because they want to be a part of this song. Why are my dogs barking? I don't know. Let's open the door and find out. I want to sing a song about washing in New York City. Let's wash all of our sins away. What are my sins? I don't know. What are your sins? I don't want to know. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Whoa! I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Whoa! I don't know what I'm singing, but I'm singing this for you. Wait a second. I said it wrong. Let's try it again. I don't know what I'm singing. I don't know what I'm singing, but I'm singing it for you. You, 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 too. Ha, ha, doom, 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 doom. Ha, ha, I made myself laugh. I don't know what I'm doing, guys. This is what happens when I have summer off and I have nothing to do but just clean and wash my clothes all day. <sighs> Alright, guys, so our last load finally finished watching. Alright, guys, so our last load finally finished washing. I'm going to click drain. Wait a second. Now comes the next fun part. We're going to put everything from here to the dryer. When I open the dryer, it has this little disc right here that you're actually supposed to put on top of the clothing just so that it doesn't wobble out and go flying everywhere. So I open this up. If you notice closely, it has like these ridges. I don't know if you call this ridges, but like these little bumps, which is nice because it allows, you know, any water to just not fall over and it stays within these two. Nope. Get the little disc, put it on top just like this. Close, close. Five minutes. I look so tiny on the camera. Oh my god, am I really that tiny in person? I don't know, I hope not. Um, anyways, my clothes are finally dry. The only thing I have to do now is just place them on the writing rack. Let me show you where it is. Let's go. Loop, loop. One of the hallways. One of the hallways. My little foyer area. And here it is. This is really um, easily movable. So I could just place it there. Or I could put it right over here. Or what I like to do sometimes is just bring it over. Loop right over here and then here I don't have to move as much and then I could just put it right there You guys can see my little baby right here. That's Lovebug. They ran out because they heard a cell phone ring outside and it was, you know, for my neighbors, but they think that I have people over because apparently I'm a party person for them. Right, Tilly? You think I'm a party person? Don't be shy now. Come on, the camera's there, baby. Give them all your love. Also, as soon as I finished filming my video, the sun came out. Can you believe that? It was super cloudy and rainy just like an hour ago and now it's super um, sunny. Either way, if you guys stuck around, thank you guys so very much. If you have subscribed to my channel, thank you. And if you haven't, but you like my videos and you subscribe, thank you very much. I hope that you guys do consider getting a portable washer and dryer because they are life changers. They work super well. They're super cheap. They're super portable, right? And yeah, hope you guys stay safe. Good night or good day. Bye.